Hey, what's going on guys? In today's video, I'll be doing a comparison between Jasper AI and ScaleNut. Jasper AI, as many of you already know, is one of the leading AI copywriters in the market. And ScaleNut is a fairly new AI copywriter when compared to Jasper AI, but I've done some recent reviews of ScaleNut and it's really, really powerful. And it has some really useful and effective AI copywriting tools included. So in today's video, I wanted to do a head to head battle between Jasper AI and ScaleNut to see which AI copywriter will come out on top. In order to do a fair comparison, I'll be looking at the pricing differences between Jasper AI and ScaleNut, the templates included in both Jasper AI and ScaleNut. Um, also, I'll be taking a look and testing some optimization tools. I'll also be looking at the most important metric, which is the quality of output in which you can expect when using Jasper AI and ScaleNut. And lastly, I'll be assessing how easy or beginner friendly each one of these tools are. So let's get started by taking a look at the pricing differences between these two tools. And let's start by taking a look at Jasper AI. So Jasper AI has a couple of different plans in which you can choose from. The starter plan does not include the long form templates, which allow you to write long form articles and blog post. So the starter plan starts at $40 per month and you're able to get 35,000 words each month and you can go all the way up to 320,000 uh, words per month for $332 uh, per month. And that again includes 50 AI templates, the Chrome extension, 29 languages, and up to five users. Now, if you need the long form assistant and templates, which allow you to write long form content, then you would need to get the boss mode plan. And that again starts at $49, so $50, and you're able to get 50,000 words per month. And you can go all the way up to 700,000 words each month, and that will cost you $500 per month. And again, you get the Google Docs, the Compose and Command features, increased amount of content output, and you also get long form content generation and live chat support. So those are a couple plans in which you can choose from if you're getting Jasper AI. Now, if I head over to scale, now these are the plans that are available. The individual plan starts at $17 per month, and this gives you 100,000 AI words, five SEO reports, 40 plus AI tools, the right uh, for me feature and 24 seven email and chat support. If you wanted to, you can get the growth plan, which is $47. And this is their most popular plan. You get unlimited AI words, 30 SEO reports. You get the cruise mode, which allows you to create blog posts in five minutes, instructions and AI settings, paraphrasing, SERP facts, collaboration, and 30 topic clusters research each month. And if you wanted to, you can get the pro plan, which is $89 per month. And again, this gives you uh, unlimited SEO reports and everything included in the growth plan. So right off the bat, you can see that ScaleNet has a much more attractive pricing. You're able to get um, a lot more words each month for a lot less um, of the cost when we compare this to Jasper AI. The growth plan on ScaleNet is $47 per month, and that is if you pay uh, per year. And this gives you unlimited AI words. Unfortunately, on Jasper, there isn't an unlimited plan. So you can go all the way up to 700,000 words per month, but that is a lot more uh, in terms of a monthly plan that you'll be paying for Jasper when compared to ScaleNut. So in terms of pricing, I would have to go with ScaleNut over Jasper AI. The monthly plans are much more affordable when compared to Jasper AI, and you also get a lot more AI words included in your monthly plans for ScaleNut. So for pricing, I would have to go with ScaleNut. But we all know that pricing shouldn't be the only factor that you consider when choosing between an AI copywriter. So let's go ahead and take a look at some specific features, some specific templates, and also test the quality of output that we can expect when using Jasper and ScaleNut. Starting with Jasper, these are the templates that are included. As you can see, there's a bunch of different uh, types of templates in which you can choose from just dependent on the type of content in which you're writing. We have ads, blogs, e-commerce, email, frameworks, Google, marketing. SEO, some new templates, social media, video, and website. And you also have two specific templates for long form content, which you can use to create blog posts or articles. So this is the documents. Um, you can free form with any template and start writing your content. You can use a workflow or you can use the blog post starter, which will help you kick off your blog post from title ideas to an intro paragraph. And you also have a content summarizer tool, which allows you to get the key bullet points from any piece of content. So those are the templates that are included in Jasper AI. Now, if we head over to ScaleNut and head over to templates, these are the templates that are included. Again, very similar templates, um, especially when it comes to the short form templates. You have product descriptions, Q&A, article copywriting, social media posts, copywriting frameworks, website copy, video content, email copywriting, and ad copies. And if you head back over to the dashboard, you'll also be able to see um, some other long form templates, such as the cruise mode, which allows you to create a blog post in five minutes, the content brief tool, which allows you to organize and create a content brief for your articles. 
And you also have a content planner template, which allows you to research and really organize your topic clusters or blog post ideas. So in terms of templates, both ScaleNote and Jasper AI are pretty similar. There's not really any template that really jumps out to me that's not included in each one of these tools. Yes, they're a little bit different in terms of how they function, but uh, they pretty much have the same uh, templates which you can use. Now, in terms of features, there are a couple of features that are included in a uh, scale that's not included in Jasper AI and vice versa. So starting with Jasper AI, we have Jasper art that's included. So this allows you to create art using AI. Essentially, all you have to do is uh, describe an image in which you would like to generate and Jasper will generate that image for you. Now, there isn't such feature included in Scala. Now, you do have to pay extra for the art feature, but it is nice that um, you have that included in Jasper AI. On the other hand, ScaleNut has a dedicated SEO hub, which allows you to research and optimize your blog posts or articles to increase the likeness of ranking on the first page of Google. And that's built in to ScaleNut. So you wouldn't need to get an external tool or an external content optimization tool. While on the other hand, Jasper does have an integration with Surfer SEO, but you need to get an account with Surfer SEO and then integrate it and then start um, optimizing your content. So that can be um, a little bit more costly because now you have to add on a monthly subscription to Surfer SEO. I love that ScaleNut has this SEO hub included within its tool. Usually if you're getting an AI copywriter, you will need to get a content optimization tool because the AI copywriter will write the content, but you need an optimization tool to help you optimize that content for the first page of Google. So both of these tools go hand in hand and you're able to save a lot of money um, in the long run if you went ahead with ScaleNut because you have all of those features all in one place. So in terms of templates and features, I think they're both equally matched, but in terms of optimization tools and features, ScaleNet is definitely better than Jasper AI. I'll leave a link in the description below this video in which I go over the full um, walk through all the content optimization tools included in ScaleNet. So if you want to check that out, it'll be below this video. Now let's talk about one of the most important factors that you need to consider when choosing between an AI copywriter, and that's the quality of output. When it comes to quality of output, it's hard to have a blanket statement and say one AI copywriter is outright better than the other AI copywriter, especially when we're comparing Jasper AI and ScaleNet, which I believe to be two of the best AI copywriters in the market. The quality of your content is really going to be dependent on the type of content in which you're generating, how much information you're giving the AIs, and also what niche um, your content is in and what niche you're writing about. So again, it's really difficult to say that one AI copywriter is outright better than another AI copywriter. I may think that Jasper AI is better than um, ScaleNet for the type of content in which I'm creating, but someone else may use ScaleNet and say that they actually like it more uh, for their niche and the type of content in which they're uh, creating. But for reference, I generated two different blog posts for the same topic using Jasper AI and ScaleNet, and these were the results. The blog post topic is the best credit card for travel points. So this was the full length article in which we were able to generate using ScaleNet. If you wanna see my full tutorial of me actually doing this, I'll leave a link for that in the description below this video. But as you can see, we got a pretty uh, complete blog post which talks about what travel points are. The five best travel credit cards actually goes into some specific cards, uh, tells us how we can use those travel points, how do you obtain those points, how do they work, pros and cons, and some frequently asked questions and a nice conclusion at the end here. So a pretty complete um, article here. It's over 2000 words that we were able to generate using ScaleNet. And this was the blog post in which we got back from Jasper AI. I generated this blog post using the blog post workflow. As you can see, we got a pretty high quality article. It talks about the best credit card for travelers, um, is the one that offers the most reward points. The second best is the one with the lowest rates. Third best is the one with the longest 0% intro. The fourth best is the one with no foreign transaction fees. And the fifth best is the one with uh, travel insurance. So we don't actually go into any specific cards here, but if I took some time, I'm sure I would be able to generate some content from Jasper AI with some specific cards. But as you can see, um, we're able to get some really, really relevant and uh, actionable information for this specific blog post. In terms of quality, both of these AI copywriters produce high quality output, but I would give Jasper AI a notch higher compared to ScaleNet, and that's only because I've used Jasper AI more than ScaleNet. I've generated more content and had more experience using Jasper over ScaleNet, so that may be my personal bias, 
but I would give them a little bit of a notch higher uh, than scale nut. My best advice that I can give when it comes to quality of output is actually go out and use these tools yourself. Both Jasper AI and ScaleNut have a free trial, so you can uh, get a free trial, start using these tools, start generating some output, and figure out which one uh, is best suited for your specific niche. So if you want to try out any of these tools for free, I'll leave a link for both Jasper AI and ScaleNut in the description below this video. And lastly, for ease of use, as you saw in this tutorial, both of these tools are very, very easy to use. They're very intuitive and very easy to use, even if you have no experience using AI copywriters. So for ease of use, both of these tools get a five star. Overall, I would have to give Jasper AI a score of 22.5 out of 25. For pricing, I'd give it a 3.5 out of five because the monthly plans can be a little bit expensive and you also don't get a lot of um, monthly AI credits included when you compare that to ScaleNut. For templates, I'd give them a five. They have some really good templates. For optimization, I'd give them a four. It would be nice if they had their own built-in tools rather than just connecting it to Surfer SEO. For quality, I'd give them a five. And for ease of use, I'd also give them a five. So that would be 22.5 out of 25 for Jasper AI. And for ScaleNut, I'll give them 23.5 out of 25. Yes, that is higher than Jasper AI. I didn't think that I'd actually be able to find an AI copywriter that was better than Jasper, but I do believe ScaleNut would be a better option for a high quality AI copywriter for most people. So for pricing, I'd give them a four out of five. They have really, really attractive pricing. For templates, I give them a 4.5 out of five. Again, they also have some really good templates included. For optimization, they have some of the best optimization and SEO tools included in ScaleNut. So I'd give them a five. For quality, again, they're really, really high quality. So I'd give them a five out of five for that. And for ease of use or how beginner friendly this tool is, again, that's another five out of five. So in total, I'd give ScaleNut a score of 23.5 out of 25. Both of these tools are very high quality AI copywriters. I highly recommend that you go out and try them out for yourself. Again, I'll leave a link for both of their free trials in the description below this video. As always, I hope that you enjoyed this video and that you're able to get some clarity between Jasper AI and Skillnut. And I hope that this video allows you to make a better decision when it comes to choosing between these two AI copywriters. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give us a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Until next time, stay well.